It's the snack that smiles back. Goldfish. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It is the Turtle Girl. Today, we are talking about why you should never, ever, ever feed goldfish or minnows or any of those types of fish to turtles and kind of like animals in general because they're honestly not that great. So some people, this might strike them as kind of crazy because you walk into a pet store, most any pet store will have tanks upon tanks of comet goldfish or rosy red minnows or fathead minnows and label them as feeders and they're like i don't know 10 to 15 cents a piece but these aren't actually the best type of feeder fish for your animal and that's for a few reasons so first of all because they are so cheap and mass produced they often carry a lot of parasites diseases worms and all kinds of gross stuff in their gut and that is not healthy to be introducing those to your turtle they're also extremely fatty and your turtle can get overweight from eating them because they have so much extra nutrients and fat that your animal doesn't need and also because this is the biggest one that i think goes over a lot of people's heads is because they have what's called thiaminase in them so you're maybe wondering what the heck is thiaminase it's actually an enzyme and i'm not gonna go like too sciencey into it because you kind of get lost i did find an article on it though if you want to read that in the description below but basically it's an enzyme that breaks down thiamine and prohibits its absorption and thiamine is vitamin b1 and so you're thinking well what does that mean for the turtle what happens if he becomes vitamin b1 slash thiamine deficient well it can cause all kinds of symptoms including muscle weakness anorexia slash not eating abnormal behavior and basically can just get them pretty sick so there's a lot of drawbacks to feeding goldfish and minnows and other feeders like this. So why not go for alternatives? Because there are so many alternatives out there, some that are even easier than going out to the pet store and buying feeder goldfish. So for instance, live bearing fish, such as guppies or platies or mollies, because these live bears, basically they give birth to live young and they're like miniature versions of the adults. You raise them up for a couple months and then you can feed them to your turtle. Now what's great about this is that you are raising them at home you know what's going into them you know that they are healthy hopefully and it's all around better for your turtle and it's also easier because you basically get them for free you don't have to go anywhere um yes you do have to get it started like a couple of months beforehand but once you start getting babies then you can just continually feed them to your turtle and also you don't have to even do fish but you can feed other things such as snails so ram's horn snails are like unbelievably easy to breed just put a little heat in their tank and they will be laying eggs and you will have tons and tons of baby snails and so that's kind of all i wanted to say for today's video i know it's kind of shorter but i'm actually out of state right now so if you want to see what's going on with me make sure you follow my social medias and because we're talking about feeding fish why don't we end on a feeding video because you guys tend to like that i'm gonna do some snails um if you don't want to see snails being eaten by turtles i will see you guys later now we're gonna go feed the turtles all right guys, so I am here editing today's video, but I just wanted to pop in really quickly and let you guys know that we are so close to 5,000 subscribers. I'm really excited and I thought it'd be a fun idea to do a Q&A video. So if you have any questions for me, please leave those in the comments below. I'll be picking a couple and I could pick yours. So if you would do me that one favor, I would really appreciate it. I hope you guys get to see that Q&A video soon and let's get back to the feeding. All right, so we're gonna give him some more snails. He's already kind of eyeballing them. They're right there. So these are ram's horns. And if you listen, you might be able to hear them crunch. We'll see if he'll take them from my fingers. Please don't bite me. Okay, okay, it's right there. It fell down. I don't have any more. No, stop. Look, it's right there. It's right there. Take the snail. Are you gonna eat it? There you go. Did you already eat it all? Oh my gosh, that was fast. Okay, let's try one more. This is a smaller one. You can like barely. It's very small. Okay, here we go. Look, he knows. Don't bite my finger, please. Okay, there you go. Did you finish it already? 
Seriously? Well, he really loves those snails, but I hope you guys enjoyed that. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Just please, I implore you, think twice when feeding goldfish or rosy red minnows to your turtle because they're really not the best option. And I hope it helped you. If it did, please feel free to drop a thumbs up. And I will see you guys next week. Have a totally awesome day. Bye!